Today's video is brought to you by Technically Not a Technician. I'd like to share a short video about my Asteroids Arcade. I've always wanted to have a flight simulator, and this is about as close to that as I'll ever get. This unit is a PC build with Batisera installed. I've got lots of games on it. However, I built this unit with one game in mind. That game is Top Gun. On the NES. I've never been able to land on the aircraft carrier after the first mission, and I'm hoping this arcade will help with that. Before I play Top Gun and try and land on that aircraft carrier once and for all, I'd like to demo a few games so you get an idea of the overall gameplay on this modded arcade cabinet. As I said I happen to have Batisera installed. Personally if I'm wanting to get a main cabinet up and running, and I'm using PC hardware, Batisera is a great option. If you're into MAME arcades you've got to give it a try. It's very easy to start a game, and when you're done it's just as easy to back out. I also think that navigating the menus is very intuitive. I'm only going to demo one game that's listed on the cabinet as all of them have that old school Vega graphics. Asteroids is the arcade cabinet that the one-up was modeled off of so I'll demo it. However, I do have the others installed and working. In fact my son kind of rocks it when he plays Lunar Lander. Our type is a lot of fun on this unit. Gundams are cool. But this cabinet takes a minute to boot up. So the AI software that I use to make my voiceovers is unable to say Gundams. Check it out, Gundams 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 Gundams. Yeah, I'm not even able to correct the pronunciation.
so you want to take a closer look? I think it looks better in person, to tell you the truth. It really seems washed out on camera. This monitor is a generation 1 monitor, and I believe a lot of people felt they could have used a higher quality one. I've never really had an issue with it until now. Now let's give Top Gun a try. Okay, in this video it looks like we're flying in a snowstorm. I'm telling you in person it looks better. I'm just hoping that when it's time to land on the carrier the snowstorm has passed. looks as if it's time to land. Kind of thanking God that the snow has let up. But will that be enough to help me land?
I'm going to tell you right now, I think Nintendo made this impossible. I hate that I still can't land this plane. Guess it's good I'm not a pilot in real life. Thank you for watching my video, and I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to like comment, subscribe, and feel free to share.